Hi everyone, I've just come to share you, with you a journal that I've made. This journal is for Diana and Diana had asked me to make one uh, more or less the same as what you're just about to see but I'd done it I think it was about two weeks ago now. So it was a, a six and three quarter by four and three quarter with a two inch spine. It's a hard cover but it's got fabric um, over the top and then we've got this lace here. Uh, there's a different uh, thinner lace on this one than there was on the other one because I didn't have any more of that. There is a book plate which is left blank, there's a seam binding bowl here with a bead dangle, there's bead dangles on the edges, seam binding closure, some bead dangles down the bottom, <clears throat> so let's front and back, let's do a quick flip. <clears throat> so it's not identical but it is very similar, I used the same papers which was from Willow, Birch and Clover and I'd shrunk these down to 80% of what they originally were. So here we've just got a pocket and a tag and there's some layering here with some ephemera and some paper and these uh, images are from Tsunami Rose. There was a request for no stenciling, so there's no stenciling in this one. Um, we've got music paper, there is uh, ephemera paper clipped onto um, some of the pages as it was on the other one. There's lined paper. We've got a pocket here with some more ephemera. Some edge punching. There's a paper bag here. Uh, there's a pocket on the paper bag with some more ephemera. This is just a little flip out. Some of the ephemera is slightly different as well. Uh, we've got a pocket here with some more ephemera. This image here, which is from Tsunami Rose. I think most of the um, ephemera is from Tsunami Rose. So there is plenty of places to journal in this one. Middle of the signature with the bead dangle. Some more uh, ephemera. This is a double one and it's paper clipped on as is this. We've got a pocket here with the tag and some ephemera. Got another pocket here, some more ephemera and this lovely cute little image. And the paper bag has been stapled, been folded over and stapled there to create this pocket. Got one of these little um, it's like a four metal embellishment, as um, you can see that. That was the last two, there's another one inside here. So that's me run down of them, I don't know. I've tried to find something similar here in the UK, but I can't seem to find them. Um, probably just looking in the wrong places. <coughs> here we've just got a, a booklet, which is paper clipped on. got glue stuck to my fingers and it's really annoying me. <laughs> Some more ephemera here. Another bead dangle. It's one of these, uh, it's a flip, it's got a pocket with the ephemera and a piece of ephemera there is the pocket and then inside here well it's pocket and there's some more ephemera. Here we've got another tuck there, some more crocheted trim and a bead dangle, some more ephemera and this is just folded in half. Again it's all from Tsunami Rose, paper bag, I'd run out of the other ones so I've used this kind of merchandise one. Here we've just got a pocket with a double journaling card, oh that, these are actually from Artie Mays. Um, some of the the fold out ones are Artie Mays. Here we've just got a ticket belly band with a tag and some more ephemera and it all just slips in there. Some more ephemera just paper clipped onto the music paper and again this is Artie Mays. bead dangle, a pocket here, a 
nearly at the end. Use the same image as I did in the uh, other one to make one of these pockets, and it's so cute. Them little kiddies. <laughs> Tag, some ephemera. This folds out. And that all pops in there. Another little booklet. And one of these like full metal embellishments again. Some more ephemera, just paper clipped on. As is this. Another bead dangle. And post uh, a postcard. <laughs> it was because I seen that. Um, a tag and some more ephemera and a pocket there and that is the back so that is the journal um, I hope you like it Diana um, enjoyed making it it's a cute little journal so if you have any questions just ask and thank you for watching bye